the HomePod Mini, everything you should know about it and why even in 2021, you should consider buying it for your next smart speaker coming up next. Hey guys, I'm Everyman Tech. This is your one-stop shop for tech reviews and tech tutorial videos. Now, if, if you want in the market for a good smart speaker and you just didn't know which one to get, well, we're gonna be talking about the HomePod Mini by Apple. And I think you're gonna be pretty surprised about how much this little smart speaker can do. So sit back and relax as we're gonna go through the tech specs and some main features and my overall opinion on why you should be considering this smart speaker in 2021. So if you, in case you're new to this channel, um, it can be followed, I can be followed on Twitter and Instagram at Your Everyman Tech, and I'll have the link to those social media platforms below. And I definitely will invite you to subscribe, comment, and like, as you will get value out of this video as among my other videos that I already made too. So definitely hit that subscription button and definitely turn on your all notifications so you can be notified of all new video uploads. So without further ado, let's get into the video. Now, when you first take the HomePod Mini out of the box, you will notice that this mesh is a mesh that mesh fabric, which is acoustically um, built, meaning that the fabric itself is not just for aesthetics, but it also allows for proper ventilation of the speaker itself. And also more importantly, it allows for the proper um, acoustic sounds and anything else that you plan on plan on it to illuminate the room or wherever you're putting it in. And along with that mesh fabric, you will also notice the small form factor is that yes, it is the HomePod Mini, but don't be fooled that it's not like really tiny. And it is like a, like a ball kind of cylinder shape, but, and we'll talk more about that design later on in the tech specs, but just knowing that it is very light. And again, when you're putting this under your desk or in your table or anywhere else that you might find a space for it, it will not take up a lot of space, which is awesome. So this makes it ideal for any location or any desk or um, organized or table setting. And also too, for um, the color choices, right now there's only two color choices available and those color choices are space gray and white. And now for the main features of the HomePod Mini. Now, this does a lot, so I'm just gonna give you my top features of why I think that I, uh, why I purchased it and also why I think you should purchase it or at least consider buying it for your next smart home speaker. And it all starts with the Siri Virtual Assistant. Now, what Apple product would it be without it being an actual Siri Virtual Assistant? So, as the name implies, you can ask Siri to anything, you can ask it to locations you can ask it for music choices food menus anything you can think of you can ask it and this is no different with the home pod mini you can ask it for mapping directions and you can ask it for all types of stuff and it will give you all the answers that you need when you want it and it also too along when you have it paired with your apple device you it will actually send like let's say for instance mapping directions you can ask it on your HomePod Mini, and it will actually send the directions to you on your phone. So you don't have to worry about trying to write stuff down. It will automatically sync to your, since it's already paired with your phone anyway. If you wanted to take those directions with you, you can actually have that sent to your phone. So you can have it right on your phone and vice versa. So, and also too, with that Siri Virtual Assistant, of course, with all smart technology going on these days with smart home tech, it also pairs home with um, Apple Home and you can, you can use that technology or the Siri virtual assistant rather to control lights, um, anything or cameras and security, anything you have smart tech and it's compatible, you will be able to control it with your smart, um, with your HomePod mini. And the next feature that I like about this HomePod mini, which I'm sure that you will love, especially for my home theater lovers out there, is the surround sound home speaker option. Now, I'm sorry, not the home speaker, but the surround sound speaker option. Now what this is, is when you buy two, you know, now you at least have two HomePod minis to do this. When you buy two HomePod minis, you can actually pair them together and it will work as a left and right pair. So what this means is that it will actually create like a sound of sound bar where if you're playing audio through it, you can hear both sounds coming through both speakers as if you're listening to um, the headphones same way that works with the left and right, it works the same way with the HomePod Mini. So why is this important? If you, let's say, if you're looking at this is a music or let's say on, you have an Apple TV. Now again, with Apple TV, with the HomePod Mini, you can stream 
your uh, you can stream your audio or connect it via Bluetooth as if you would with headphones. You can be able to connect that Apple TV to your HomePod Mini now instead of listening to your movies or your TV shows through your headphones. Like let's say late at night, you're gonna actually put them on the HomePod Minis itself. And since they're paired as a left and right speaker channel, they will actually sound like big um, home theaters surround um, home theater sound bars. So if you're someone looking to upgrade your uh, audio as far as your home theater, but you was on a budget and let's say you was not into the sound bar or like the 5.1 or 10.1 and all those crazy sound system options, you can just buy two of these HomePod minis, pair them together as a left and right pair and you'll actually be able to get that home theater quality sound uh, as if you had a big tech decked out home theater system or a big um, smart speaker not smart speaker but I'm sorry but a sound bar and as far as the next feature I'm about to talk about is of course with any Apple device Apple talks to Apple easily with ease and this is no different with pairing any Apple device to your HomePod mini it's effortless and like with the headphones if you have airpods or anything like that you will be able to connect your phone to your HomePod mini or your laptop to your HomePod mini with ease and this next feature I'm going to talk about, I'm going to have to say will be my favorite feature that this HomePod Mini offers that and no other smart speaker offers this feature. And what this feature is, it's called the handoff feature. Now, exactly as it sounds, if you say if you listen to a podcast or listen to some music on your iPhone, all you have to do is take your iPhone and you hold it over and you uh, touch it or come close to it, the HomePod Mini. Now, you will see what it say on your phone to transfer. And what you have to do is hit that. And it will, what it will do is it will transfer the audio or your podcast from your phone to your HomePod Mini. So let's say if you was, come, you was in a car or you was coming in the house walking. And now that you're in the house getting settled and you say you want to put your phone down. But you, not, or you, you don't want to, you know, you still want to be able to listen to your music in your podcast, right? So all you have to do is actually take your phone hold over the HomePod Mini and the audio will be transferred from your phone directly to the HomePod Mini. So now what you was listening to on your iPhone, now you'll be able to listen to that on your HomePod Mini. And it works vice versa as well. Let's say if you're doing some work or you're in the house relaxing and you was listening to some music or your podcast on the HomePod Mini. And let's say you want to go and you to step out of the house, you got to go somewhere, go to work. Now, what you need, all you can do is do the same thing. Hold your phone over the HomePod Mini, and it will actually transfer the audio from your HomePod Mini to your phone, so you can take it on and go with you as you leave the house. So, yeah, again, the handoff feature is only accessible through the HomePod Mini, and no other smart speaker has that feature. So, definitely something to consider if you was looking at upgrading or getting your first smart speaker. All right, now into the good stuff, the tech specs. Now, but the first thing you want, you will notice, and you may not notice off the bat, or just listening to it, it will be that this thing is powered by computational audio. Now, not to get all nerdy or techy about it, what it does is pretty much is the algorithm that work, works within the HomePod Mini speakers configuration, which allows you to hear the music or your podcast or whatever audio that you're playing through it in a 360 degree motion. So that means that no matter where you are in the room, you'll still be able to pick up the sound and still keep the same quality, no matter if you're behind it, beside it, in front of it, doesn't matter. Anywhere in the room or in the vicinity of the HomePod Mini, you'll be able to still be able to hear crisp audio and crisp music and things of that nature and not lose quality. And if you were interested in purchasing the HomePod Mini, I will definitely link a, link, a purchasing link for that below so that way you can definitely take a look at it or definitely have a buy it without having to go searching around. And again, this is an affiliated link, so I also get a small commission of the sale or if any HomePod Mini, but this doesn't cost you many and it actually might even save you money in the long run. As a lot of those affiliate links that I use are current, are discounted, so you definitely could be saving some, but you will definitely never pay more than what the price is, even if you wasn't using it outside the affiliated link. And again, I thank you for your support. 
and supporting this channel because all funds go to this channel getting the tech so i can review for you guys so you guys can get the full value of what you're purchasing and get those honest reviews as i promise that i will give to you so all right guys so i hope you guys got some value out of this video i hope I hope we helped you get some insight on what the HomePod Mini was and what it off what it had to offer. So, again, I want to definitely thank you for taking the time out of your day or night to check out this video and to get some value out of this review. And I invite you to follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Your Everyman Tech, and you can find a link to that below. And you can also um, definitely I'm gonna recommend you subscribe to this channel because I definitely want you to be educated on the new tech and not just i'm not just reviewing the tech but i'm also gonna have other videos where i actually explain how to use them and definitely get the most out of it so that way you won't feel like you're forced to go buy something and you're just not getting the full you know use out of it and which you pay your hard-earned money for you definitely should be able to so again my name is darren with everyman tech i hope you guys have a great safe day bye